All right, so we are under a bridge here. We're at a little spot called Jessup Mills. It's on the Dan River in North Carolina, right before the Virginia border. And uh, we're gonna walk over to where there's a dam near the old mill, but for now, I thought this um, little spot here next to the pylons on the bridge looked like it might hold some fish. So we're gonna see if we can get on anything. Uh, today's goal is to get on some trout. I've never caught a trout before. And uh, I'm thinking today might be the day. Hopefully. Gail scaring away all the butterflies. Those are uh, tiger swallow tails there. Looks like they're mating. Lazy River, inner tubing, tubular. Ah, classic example. Well, not much was biting and I just removed what might have been the only brush pile, so. I believe I'm going to get this off of the kayak ramp area. And we're going to go somewhere else. Man, it is like Butterfly City over here. Just wanted to show you guys this real quick. They don't really come out very often. That is a female Dobson fly. They can give you a good pinch, but are otherwise harmless. Yeah, you don't see them uh, come down out of the deep woods uh, too, too often, so definitely worth a shot there. So we're walking through a little magnolia part of the forest here. It's really pretty. It's like walking through the jungle. I just wanted to show you guys. Got to duck down in a couple places here. This trail should lead to the dam. Very pretty spot. It smells great too. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I want to just get to the dam and uh, start fishing, but I keep coming across these areas here that are so pretty. This is an old, the old house that's on the mill property here. Just some really neat stuff to see. It's a bit of a little tourist destination, an old chicken coop. Super pretty area. Yeah, even just the walk to the spot is gorgeous. You got uh, old part of the river there, river here. And this walkway through the forest is uh, just really pretty. So we're about up on the, uh, the dam now. A little wooden walkway. Hoping I can find a spot to fish when we get here. So that looks like some old uh, mechanism for the dam there. Probably keep it separated. Okay. Walk down this way to get to the water. What do you think? Of, what do you think about right there? Watch your step, it's slippery. Bit of a big step there. Mm, all right. Great. I got a nice little platform to put all my stuff. You want us to set the chairs up? Yeah. Okay. Sure do. I think this will be the spot for the day. Yeah. I mean, just this pool right here in front of us ought to be good. All right, so first I want to throw the, uh, you know, the little floor out and see how I do with that. You know me, I'm always wanting to do it with the lures. We'll see what's in here. This ought to be the spot where fish are. Well, that doesn't bode well. 
First fish of the day, fall fish. Oh dear. Oh dearie dear. Yeah, fall, fall fish are trouble because they bite the hell out of everything before anything else even gets a chance. Yeah. I never thought about it, but that would be a pretty fun thing to do, just like a uh, lazy river, you know? Yeah, what do you have there? That looks like a big fat green sunfish. That is a huge green sunfish. You're not used to being caught, are you? And you ain't never been caught. All right, Gail just caught a big fat green sunfish. I guess I'm gonna have to put worms on, or you're gonna be the only one catching anything all day. Another fall fish. Not a good sign at all. All right, well, to this day, I have never caught a, uh, a fish on a rooster tail or inline spinner. But I think today might be the time and the place to try one. We'll give this little guy a try. Maybe the flashing and shining will help out. I never understand why I can't get a bite on these things. They, uh, they look great to me in the water. By all accounts, I should be able to catch. Ah, sh what I throw right into a rock? I'm back at it. God, what the hell? Oh, that's some old line. Probably mine. Oh, you're killing. You're killing the green sunfish scene. Unfortunately, unfortunately, it's like that's all that's in here. I got him. Back after these massacres. All right, much later. Something keeps biting me right over there if I cast directly into the falls. I'm trying to see what it is. You think a friggin' treble hook would get at it, you know. It can hook into the, you know, the back of my shirt or the pocket of my jeans, but it can't hook a fish when it bites it. What do you got? Well, it's the pumpkin seed. Ah, okay. Uh, you're slaying those green sunfish. That's probably the only damn thing in here. I don't know what's hitting this thing, but it cannot like get a hold of it. I just got hit three times with no catch. And there you go, a little bluegill. Tiny bluegill. Very nice. I think that's a green sunfish. Maybe a different color. I don't know though, actually. His mouth isn't very big. Yeah, it's tiny. It looks like a little hybrid of some kind. He's got orange eyes, too. Yeah. He's still, buddy. I don't yeah. know about that one. All right. I think I got something. Yeah! Oh, that is a big fall fish. Very big. All right, so that's the biggest fall fish I've shown you on the channel, obviously. Uh, I'm gonna have to turn the camera off to get him off. He is hooked with all three trebles in a soft mouth. So yeah, this is gonna be a big pain in the d Y'all have fun. Have a good time. Oh, yeah. All right, I gave up on lures. We just got a worm on a hook now. 
I suppose it was nice to catch a fish on an inline spinner finally. All right, got something. Please don't be a fall fish. It's a fall fish. God. Ugh, ate him. Oh, you caught a nice big size one, huh? That's probably the best fish this video is going to have, so let's see it. Big red breast sunfish. Oh, yeah, hold them in the light like that. Gorgeous. Let me see the tail. Yeah, there you go. That's nice and big. Good job. Okay, got something. Nice. Oh, red breast sunfish. Unexpected. Actually catching fish on rooster tails today. How about that? Unheard of. Got something. They slammed it. What do we got? Damn. Somebody left their whole rod here. Huh. Alright, so we're headed now for the evening. On the way back out, I just wanted to get another shot of this place. This place is really, really pretty. It's got a kind of an old country charm to it that I just love. Okay. Thanks for visiting the fish dimension.